Using ONTAP System Manager Guided Setup, you can quickly configure your new cluster. Before starting Guided Setup, you should have installed and cabled your system following the installation and setup instructions for your NetApp model. If you are using a Windows computer, there is no need to connect a serial cable. Just connect your computer to the same IP subnet as your new storage controllers. The controllers appear in the Windows Network Neighborhood. System Manager guides you through initializing your cluster. If you have more than two nodes, you will add the additional nodes later. After your cluster configuration completes, ONTAP already begins checking on your system's security. You will need to verify that your connection is safe. After that, you will be able to sign back in to ONTAP System Manager and continue the setup. You now see the dashboard view. The next step is Local Tier Setup. After you click Prepare Storage under Capacity, the drives in your system are combined into one or more local tiers. Don't worry about RAID groups or stripes or other details. ONTAP automatically picks the best configuration based on your specific hardware. In networking, you may or may not be prompted to enter license keys depending on the system you purchased. Some systems have license keys that are installed at the factory. If your license keys have not been installed, you are prompted to enter them. Next, you need to configure the protocols that your clients use to access storage. The protocol choices you see depend on the licenses that are installed. You can always install new licenses later if you decide you need additional protocols or features. Finally, you can provision some storage to get started. Just click the choices you want and System Manager will guide you through a few easy steps. And that's it. You have set up your cluster and can start using it. Configuration is now complete and your dashboard has changed. You will now see that the setup steps have been replaced by status and performance displays.